This is a bit of a trial and error. Are we actually doing this right now? Oh my god, hi! <laughs> I don't have a clue what I'm doing. So I got this camera yesterday because for the longest time I wanted to set up some sort of channel to show you guys the behind the scenes of just my day-to-day -day life, especially when it comes to music. Um, but I don't know, like, am I supposed to look here, here? Um, I don't really know how to work it. I don't know how I'm gonna edit it. Um, I'm sure I'll figure it out. But if you're seeing this, it's it's pretty much a miracle. But I just thought it would be fun to bring you guys along, especially like, for example, this week is a show week. Um, so I have a show on Saturday in Dublin, which I'm so excited about. But just like bring you guys along and show you what I kind of do on these weeks and just like behind the scenes of my life as a singer like in the studios and stuff but then also day-to-day -day life as well so I hope you enjoy I actually talk to myself and sing to myself around the house all the time but when it's like a structured time to do so it's definitely harder I feel like this feels very professional do you know what I mean but yeah I think this is gonna be fun if you're here thank you so much definitely subscribe this is a brand new channel so I need all the help I can get so subscribe 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 like and comment let me know what you want to see going forward but this is gonna be a journey so i'm so happy you guys are on this with me i also need to stop talking with my hands <laughs> oh, i'll see you in the nail salon and the nails are finished can we see them up close Oh yeah, there we go. I went with metallic because I don't 100% know what colour I'm wearing, but I love them. Oh my god, it's actually such a nice day out in Ireland for once. Anyway, I got all the band a little mini Easter egg because actually my show is on Easter Saturday this weekend. Um, I just got jellies and some other little snacks. And I'm actually already like 10 minutes late and having that yet. So we really need to get on the road. We are at rehearsals. Hello, vlog. Hello. <laughs> What's going on? How's everyone getting you on? Get a lot better vlog. <laughs> um, I don't know about that, yeah. Mark. <laughs> <laughs> Here, I got everyone a little Easter egg. Ah, oh, oh, Lord, thank you so much. No props. Here we go from the top. Yeah. Become cool for believing in things that I can't see. Star signs, the fatal lines, and all things in between. Even though we shouldn't fear, you're the only one. It feels right with. I'll just go. <laughs> you know, better not that's mess it up, Mark. What song are you most excited for on Saturday? Um, Wait, oh, do you want to introduce yourself? Oh, I'm Mark, by the way. Um, <laughs> what do you play? You wouldn't. Uh, guitar. You can't really tell. Keyboard. <laughs> vocals. Um, You're just so talented. Yeah, super talented. <laughs> um, I'm looking forward to Don't Tell Me. Really? Yeah. Is that your favorite? Yeah, yeah, I'm loving the way I just love the way it sounds. Yeah. Nice one. Right, we have Confi on the drums. Yeah, we do. What <laughs> song are you most excited to play? Ooh, uh, Taking Back My Heart. Definitely. That is one of your faves, yeah. And the new ones. And the new ones. Oh, yeah. Right, Exciting. Stephen. I'm excited for all of it, Leah. Like, I'm Stephen, <laughs> by the way. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on. Don't let, me, uh, don't let me spoil this out list. I'm excited for Stronger Together. Stronger Together is a great one, in fairness. Sounds cool. I'm excited for Stolen. <laughs> it's show day! Oh my god, I'm so excited. It's 9am, I let myself have a bit of a lie in. I'm on stage at quarter to nine tonight. Um, and I woke up to see that there's people queuing outside already, which is insane. Just came out for a little walk to get my head in the right place. Actually, it's such a nice morning. Blue skies. Oh my God, I spoke too soon. It's starting to rain and I washed my hair last night. I do not have time to wash it again today, so it cannot get wet. Um, just my look. And I look crazy. These hoods are so ugly. <laughs> it is makeup time. 
I did wake up with a couple of breakouts, which is really annoying. Um, I did a big skincare at night last night and I actually think I aggravated it myself. Anyway, nothing that we can't cover. So I'm actually getting ready at home today because we have a sound check straight into a meet and greet and then have like an hour and a half to do my hair and get into my outfit and a vocal warm up and all that kind of stuff. And then I'm on stage, so it's like quite a quick day. Um, so it's just easier that I got ready at home, which is oh God. This is my little makeup kit that I bring with me to shows and stuff. You can put like your products in the top, it's really hard to see. And then like a big base to put all like my palettes and stuff in, um, rather than bringing like a hundred makeup bags, which I used to do. I realized though I never properly explained like my story and who I am for anyone who doesn't know me. So I'll give you a little bit of insight as to who I am and why the hell I have started this channel. So I am a singer-songwriter from Ireland. I always get slagged by my friends for saying singer-songwriter. Um, but I'm like, that's what I do. I love writing songs, so I'm gonna say it. Um, I'm 23 years old and I've been in the music industry for just over three years. Basically, I have been singing since I was like, four or five, always loved it, wanted to do it when I got older, but didn't have a clue how to get there. Didn't have any contacts in the music industry. Yo, yo. I feel sick. Why? This is a show day and I'm so excited. It's show day. Oh, I started missing it. Why did what you do? Spotify start crying. <laughs> Stop, I'm so excited. I know, I'm so excited. It's gonna be great. That was my manager. Um, buzzing. She gets more nervous than I do before shows. So funny. Anyway, I went to college to study economics. I went to the University of Limerick. I absolutely loved it down there. I lived away from home because I'm actually from Kildare. But obviously, wasn't a dream. It wasn't a dream career. And um, this was. But like I said, I just didn't really know how to get into it. So it was really weird. I was in my second year of college. Um, and obviously, COVID came and we were all sent home. And I was home then for about, what, three or four months. Um, and I started posting covers and original songs on TikTok. And just really weird, like wasn't expecting much from it at all. I was really like kind of shy about my music. So me posting online was like a massive deal. But all my family and friends were so supportive um, and that kind of kept me going. Then unfortunately my granddad passed away during COVID. And this had probably been like six weeks since I started posting. Um, and the morning of his funeral, I got a text from an Irish manager just saying he'd love to have a meeting with me. And like in a really weird way, I think that was like a gift from my granddad. That might sound a bit wacky, but I think so. So that was May 2020. And then that meeting with him went really, really well. And then I met my second manager who is the girl you just heard on the phone there. Um, so I'm still with the two of them today. And yeah, I just started kind of going to writing sessions that summer and writing some music. And then I released my debut single, Older, in October 2020. I released Older on the 23rd of October 2020, which is like, for me, the day everything changed, kind of. So I actually have, um, I have this necklace that says Leo Hard on it. But then also, I don't know how to show you guys. It has um, the day older was released. Can you see that? Anyway, this necklace is so worn now because I literally wear it. I've worn it every single day since then, pretty much. But it's like my little lucky charm necklace. Yeah, so that was like, Jesus, three and a half years ago almost now, which is crazy. So the last three years I've just been performing, writing. I dropped out of college, obviously. Um, best thing I ever did. Um, and I never thought I'd be someone to drop out of college. Like that would have scared the shit out of me if you had told me that a couple years ago. But I'm following my dreams, baby. So anyway, tonight's show is in a venue called the Academy in Dublin, and I have played here before. It's such a nice venue to play. And I have a new band with me that we've been working together the past like four months. So I'm really excited to be up there with them and we're playing lots of new songs, lots of like unreleased songs. Um, but yeah, I cannot wait. So you guys are gonna come along with me for the whole day, every ounce of the day you will be there. So I hope you enjoy what am I doing? I actually need to get on the road. I don't know what I'm doing. I had the whole day, well, no, I didn't. I had until half two, as I tend to do. Haven't packed anything up yet. It always works out in the end. And we're ready to go. 
The car is packed. The outfit is in. I don't think I've forgotten anything. I freaking hope not. Uh, the roller, she's in. Hopefully she looks good. And it's time to drive up. So it's gonna take me about an hour to get there. I am actually early for once. We got it all done very quickly and I'm very excited. So next time I see you, I will be in the venue. Oh, hey. <laughs> What's the crack? What's going on? Hey. hey. How are you? We have just arrived to the venue. Let me show you. The band are setting up on the stage. It all feels very real now. Trying to pick the right position for the piano. I think it looks good like that. I'm right here. Right there. I'm gonna come down though and um, I'll be down in one sec. Most of the show day I end up just running around trying to get things sorted. Here's a little back step to get down to the stage. Come out here. Okay, dressing room tour. Now it's a bit messy because we have been in here. Just giving everyone a tour of the dressing room. These are my lovely flowers. Got some water, we got some Easter snacks. My band are line checking and then I'm gonna sign check. So let me show you. Oh yeah, you're gonna sell it out for me. <laughs> oh, very good. They look very professional, who are we? <laughs> this is where if you are a person coming to watch the show, this is what you see. Welcome to Stage. I just did my hair, I put these little bows in. I can't tell if I love them or hate them, but they're staying in now. They took me so long to do. Um, I need to get into my outfit, I need to do a bit of a vocal warm up. The nerves are kicking in, guys. The nerves are kicking in, but also the excitement. Um, 30 minutes to stage, I can't believe it. I really shouldn't come out here, but I'm just going to show you a sneak peek. Hello. Good luck! <laughs> The trouble is every heartbreak all the ever had starts like this. I like your baby, that's a bad sign. We are stage ready. Right? I 
I'm so excited. Yeah. Oh, I bet I'm on the camera. I just love that you're like going out as if you're going to rob a bind. Oh, yeah. I'll be down to pick those go to views. What do you do with all that love? With all that love, you stole from us. What do you do with all that love? With all that love, you stole from us. What do you do? We are done! I had the most amazing night. Oh my god. Fucking. Oh, right! Throwing fucking oranges at me. Bitch. <laughs> Need to pack up the car now and go meet my friends. Okay, I forgot my camera. But, how did I do? So amazing. So amazing. So amazing. And relax. It is the next day now, it is Easter Sunday, and me and my mum have come away for a little night away together just to chill, um, and I feel so relaxed, but I was just reflecting on last night and just how amazing it was. Honestly, everyone that came, the energy was immaculate. <laughs> they were like the best and loudest crowd that I've ever heard. Um, they sang and danced and we just had so much fun and they played some new songs. Um, which I think went down really well. Um, and yeah, just everything I ever could have dreamed of happened. So I am literally on cloud nine and I'm just literally taking today to chill. Let's go to the beach each, let's go get away. Let me show you these views. My favorite moment of the show last night, actually, hold on. Mom. Yeah. What was your favourite moment of the show last night? When it, when it ended. <laughs> when it was over. That was the best bit. Was it, yeah? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, my favourite bit was... Um, the drummer. <laughs> <laughs> the drummer was actually excellent. I know, he's he deadly. Ex Come on, be serious, um, man. I know, I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying to be serious. You've put me on the spot now. Um, well, so is it that hard to come no, up with I'm one moment? There's so many moments. I'm trying to think of all of them. Mm -hmm. um, when you spilled water all over yourself. <laughs> oh my god. I forgot to tell that story. So it came <laughs> off at the encore, which is like three songs left. I was wearing a little red slip dress and took a drink of water, spilled the whole thing down myself, because that's what I do these days, apparently. And <laughs> had like one minute and panicked and had no hair dryer to dry it. So I went out on stage with the water all down my dress. And I did put the jacket back on to try and cover did it. Did you? It, yeah, but I didn't cover it, obviously. Yeah. It was a cropped I jacket. So I just announced to the stage that I spilled the water because I thought, yeah. I don't want people thinking otherwise. But it was grand. <laughs> My favourite moment of the show was stolen because I was really nervous yes, well, I was gonna say that. to... I've never played piano on stage before in front of people. And I was really nervous to do that. And I did it and it went really well and everyone sang with me. It was fabulous. And also my other favourite song was Hypnotic State. Yeah. Um, everyone just went off for that yeah, song, yeah, they didn't did, they? Yeah. 
Anyway, we are having a chill day today and we're about to go to the spa and just relax, which I'm so excited for. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you want to see other behind the scenes stuff, like, I don't know, anything from songwriting sessions, festival season, behind the scenes, like day to day and weekly, whatever you guys want, let me know. Um, but I really enjoyed making this video, so I'm definitely going to make a lot more and please subscribe and like and comment if you like this and share with your friends and um i'll see you guys in my next video bye